Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So after rolling out last week's Patch Tuesday security update for Windows 11 24H2, which is KB5062553, Microsoft has rolled out an emergency hotfix, which is an emergency update, also known as a out-of-band update. Regarding an issue for a small subset of Azure virtual machines running Windows Server 2025 or Windows 11 version 24H2. Now, the original issue was that when Trusted Launch was disabled and virtualization based security was enforced via the registry, the system might fail to boot after installing the July Windows Security Update 5062553 as mentioned. Now, according to Microsoft, the issue has been resolved with the hot patch update KB5064489, which you will not get through Windows Update. Most out of band updates, emergency hotfixes, roll out as a manual update that you have to download and install manually from the Microsoft Update catalog. I'll leave this linked for easy access and reference in the description. Here you've got version 24H2, 64 bit. 24H2 ARM64. You click on the relevant download for your system. And if you don't know how to download and update manually from the catalog, I'll leave a link in the description and in the end screen for a video I have posted on that. Now, obviously, this is affecting more corporations and enterprises, but there might be a handful of home users who would need this update if affected. And Microsoft says that this out of band update includes quality improvements. And the update is cumulative. So it includes security fixes and improvements from the July 8th, 2025 security update, KB5062553, in addition to the following. This update, Microsoft says, addresses an issue that prevented some virtual machines from starting when virtualization-based security was enabled, as I mentioned at the beginning. It affected VMs using version 8 which is a non-default version, where VBS was offered by the host. In Azure, this applies to standard, non-trusted launch general enterprise VMs running on older VM SKUs. The problem was caused by a secure kernel initialization issue. So that's what this update is addressing. With Microsoft saying the issue was resolved, because this was an official known issue, so it's been resolved in the out-of-band update 5064489 and Microsoft says that if your virtual machine configuration is impacted by this issue, it recommends installing this out of band update instead of the monthly security update, which was KB5062553. So I think this is affecting more the minority than the majority, but nonetheless, it is an out of band emergency update. So just to keep you guys posted like we like to do on the channel. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.